for the Wilson quick tap tapping tool, uh, a common adjustment that needs to be made is to adjust the punt, the tap length in the tool. So to do that, flip the tool over. And we want to adjust the tap length, so we're going to start by removing the stripper plate, which means I need to remove the large snap ring here, which lets me get at the stripper plate. Now I can remove that. Rotate the oil nozzle out of the way. And now there's another snap ring that holds the pitch insert into the tool. So I'll remove that. And now I can remove the entire pitch insert along with the tap. And I want to adjust this length. So the normal length is 46 millimeters or 1.810 inches. But if I want to adjust that for some reason, for example, if I'm going to be tapping a, an extruded hole, I might want to shorten this up a little bit to allow more clearance for that extrusion. So I can just screw this in or out to adjust that length. Take a caliper, measure that length, and keep adjusting until I'm comfortable with the length. Once I like what I have, I put this back into the tool Make sure that I line up one of the notches on the side of the pitch insert with, with the pin on the tool. Then I reinstall that snap ring that was holding that pitch insert in place. Rotate the oil nozzle back in place so it's pointing right at the tap. And I put the stripper plate back on. I've got a relief area in the stripper plate that needs to line up with the nozzle. So I put that on there. And then I put the snap ring back in to attach the stripper plate. And that's how we adjust the tap length on the quick tap tapping tool.